welcome to Nottingham to Driving School. Join us as we go through the category C plus E, HGV, Reverse Manoeuvre. Good afternoon, Martin. Uh, today we're going to be doing a demonstration of the category C plus E, HGV, Reverse Manoeuvre. What I would like you to do is drive forward to the furthest two sets of cones, which are cone A. I would like you to reverse inside cone B, ending in the bay of cones with the yellow hatchings to the rear of the vehicle. Do you understand that? Yes. Yeah. Carry on. First things first, getting into the cab. It might look easy, but here's a few top tips. Avoiding the steering wheel, maintain three points of contact at all times. Once you're inside the vehicle, prepare yourself for the road. Let's begin the manoeuvre. Proceed straight ahead to the furthest two sets of cones, referred to as cone A. As you do, you'll pass a bay of cones. This is referred to as bay C. This is where the vehicle will end up at the end of the manoeuvre. Further down from cone C, you'll pass cone B. This is where you'll transition to the other side of the course. Proceed to the furthest sets of cones, cones A, and stop the vehicle. Let's take a look at the space you've got to complete the manoeuvre. The aim of this manoeuvre is to demonstrate that you can control the vehicle and trailer without straying outside the fail lines on the outside of the course or hitting a cone. As you align the trailer for the manoeuvre, the space the vehicle has to swing around reduces. This makes it harder to align the vehicle with the trailer after setting up for the manoeuvre. The first thing the instructor will be keeping an eye on is the tyre as it swings around. If this tyre crosses over the fail line, it will be an immediate fail. You have two shunts to attempt this manoeuvre. As you set up the trailer, keeping in mind their fail lines on the outside of the course, you must align the trailer and vehicle to avoid cone B and transition to the other side of the test track. When you are clear that the vehicle and trailer will avoid cone B, start to bring the vehicle and trailer around. As you do, you must also avoid the fail lines on the outside of the course. As you bring the vehicle around, the instructor will be keeping a close eye on your position and technique. Now on the other side of the course, we are essentially parking the vehicle in the bay of cones behind us. As you approach cone C, which starts off the bay of cones where we need to end up, take your time. Slowly reverse the trailer into the bay. Stop the vehicle over the hatchings at the end of the course. Task completed, it's time to secure the vehicle. Time to check your work. Remember, you have two shunts to complete this manoeuvre, so as long as you haven't strayed outside the lines, you can reposition until you're satisfied. The instructor will give you some feedback on how you've completed the manoeuvre. Another pass with NDS. We train hard to pass easy at NDS. Learn pass, call NDS today.